Welcome to a very special episode of Press Y Y Z. We Is are the only about drugs. Yeah, probably we might we might consider doing I, that. We're I the was, only gaming I was podcast. About to make a, a shooting joke, but I realized that would not be in good taste. Yeah, that wouldn't that wouldn't be terrible. a good idea. The, the, the this week probably. Uh, Ever. You you can. <laughs> This, we are the only Canadian gaming podcast that you can uh, normally break, catch live on twitch.tv uh, slash press YYZ every Wednesday at 8 p.m. Eastern, as well as on podcast services and YouTube every Thursday. My name is AJ Fraser, and I am joined today by Alexander Kozina. Hello. As well as Nathan McInerney. How are you? Hey, how's everybody doing? It's been a while since we've all had all three of us together here yeah um yeah so uh let, let's just say this before we get started as a reminder uh we here at press yyz stand against discrimination of any kind while we appreciate however you choose to give back to our show there is no better way to support us than by being excellent to each other um yeah so we put up an announcement uh today that uh we're gonna have a bit of a state of the union and how things are going here uh w with regards to the show and we we just want to have a, a big kind of open discussion a bit about you know kind of where our heads are at and uh how we're feeling about everything um if i were to at this point if you're still listening after all that give a a tl D, D, a TLDR or a TLDDL didn't listen or a TLDW too long didn't watch um, I would say consider this not a goodbye but a see you later because we need to resynchronize our heads a little bit here with regards to the podcast proper um as it stands right now the podcast itself we will be taking a bit of a hiatus um there's what the three of us currently are at different points in our lives um you know myself just moving into a new place has been a little chaotic in its own right and i've got family coming up um in the next couple of weeks and my mother sold her house and blah, 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 blah. And, and it's been challenging for me to be able to make time for, uh, not, not the podcast specifically, but to make time f to do things to be able to talk about on the podcast. It's been challenging for me to be able to make time for, for doing that. Um, and, and we're all in, in, in our own kind of similar boat. Um, Nathan, I'm going to throw to you. Uh, how are you feeling? Yeah. Um, I think, man, I don't even know the best way to put this. Um, we we haven't been given the podcast everything we could be given. And I don't think it's fair to the podcast. I don't think it's fair to you guys. I don't think it's fair to the listeners um, who listen to us weekly. Uh, we just... I like, and I can say for myself, I haven't been as invested in the podcast personally. Um, mm -hmm. It's nothing specifically against anybody. I just don't know what happened. I, um, I just, I just want to say, I think the podcast was a great thing in the middle of a pandemic, mm -hmm. um, where everybody was on the same level playing field, right? Nobody yep. could leave. Everybody was just staying home playing video games. It was it was beautiful. It was perfect. But then as more as time went on, more and more things started to open up. Things started to go back to quote unquote normal. You know, it became difficult for everybody to ignore those prior commitments that they had. If I can stuff. just briefly kind of jump yeah. in here. I'm go sorry ahead. to kind of interrupt your flow, but nope. jumping off of that point. Uh, you know, people uh, will remember back in the day that when we first started doing press YYZ, uh, I was uh, only partially employed at the time I was writing for a YouTube channel uh, called Gamers with a V. Uh, and then some five months into the pandemic, I decided, you know what, 
for various personal reasons, uh, I'm quitting my YouTube job and I'm pretty much going to be a full-time streamer doing my own video game streams on uh, Twitch and working for Press YYZ. And that's how it was uh, until September of last year uh, when the job market opened up a little bit and I acquired and managed to get a job uh, working in quality assurance. And while that wasn't while at the time uh, that wasn't like a gong being sung for the kind of decline of press YZ, uh, in retrospect, uh, I should have recognized that it kind of would be in the end because that job, you know, much like uh, your own respective situations, uh, definitely limited how much time and effort I could put into the show. And while I, you know, still tried to uh, give it what I could, uh, inevitably I just found myself getting kind of much more burnt out and just unsatisfied with my kind of work life balance. Yeah. And, 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 you know, for my own role in that, you know, I kind of want to apologize to you cozy. Cause like we've said numerous times, like this was all your idea and this is kind of your baby to an extent. Um, and like my own personal life and even Nate, I can, Nathan just said, even for his own personal life, um, we haven't been able to give it the the same kind of attention that even you have. And, mm -hmm. you know, that on its own is not fair to you, right? Because you, you were, you were putting so much effort and pressure on yourself. And I don't, I don't really don't think you needed to, to, to be doing that, but I, I'm so grateful you did because the ones and twos are so hard to push as we both nathan and we've i tried are, we've yes. tried so hard um you do such a good job with that and so um you know i i i feel a little guilty that that i couldn't be more helpful but i with my own job and and yeah and where my life is currently at like i i didn't i barely have enough time and energy left over at the end of the day to play the things that I want to play, let alone the things that I needed to play for the podcast. You know and, what I mean? And I've already said this privately and I'll say it again here. Like you guys don't need to feel bad at all. Cause you've been totally justified in, uh, Oh dear. Uh, <laughs> you guys have been totally justified in your reasons for not being able to, you know, give it your all for the podcast. You guys have had new things come up in your lives that have made uh, them much busier than they were before. Um, but, you know, all the same, we all agree that, like, we don't want Press Wisely to be this, you know, thing that we're just sort of stringing along, kind of keeping propped up on life support, which is why we're recording this episode. Yeah. Um, Nathan, anything else you'd like to add to that? Yeah. Um, man, I'm trying to remember where I left off here. Uh, so yeah, no, I think I was just talking about, um, yeah, no, I just, oh, okay. Here, here's what I will say. Um, as over the past like three months, I've tried to do a lot, put a lot of focus on streaming and doing other things. I do want to say, Thank you to both of you two, uh, specifically for what you guys do with the podcast, because um, I really have always been not silent. That's not the right term, but the person who put the least amount of work into the podcast, I was kind of a voice on it. And you guys did a lot of stuff behind the scenes. And with me doing my own Twitch streaming now, I now see what you guys were actually putting out there. Um uh, so, uh, and you guys have put a lot of good work. And so I want to say thank you for that, uh, to both of you, uh, whether it's uploading it to, I don't know, is it anchor? Is that what we upload it to? Is yeah. We upload it to that? anchor and then it goes on to podcast services around the yeah. globe, you know, and YouTube and yeah, other yeah. things like that. So, and you create the thumbnails. You've done a great job with thumbnails, AJ. It's been thank you very always much. a highlight seeing those. That, la that last one was, was mwah, chef kiss on that. Yep. Uh, and cozy, uh, like everything you did, um, behind the scenes and created it like, and as AJ's already said, as somebody who has been streaming with OBS for what I've been streaming for like a year now and getting it, um, and I've gotten better with it. I'm nowhere near the level of what you can do. And I aspire to have your, like what you can do one day. 
um, in OBS and I want to learn. I want to get better at that. So, yeah. Absolutely. Um, yeah. So that, all that being said, what does this channel, what does this podcast, what, what can we say that that looks like moving forward? You know, one thing that we brought up uh, when we were, you know, talking about doing this episode beforehand is, uh, although us moving away from talking about uh, the news of the video game industry uh, allowed us to uh, have more fun, engage in more creative and unusual topics on the show and not feel kind of, uh, uh, what's the term? Not like enslaved, but like beholden beholden mm -hmm. to kind of what was the word of the day. Um, the fact of the matter is that being able to talk about video game news during the early days of press wise, he definitely eased some of the burden of having to come up with crazy cool kind of elaborate show topics. You know, part of one of the things that kind of led to us making this decision is that back in the day, back when, there were five hosts total. If one host dropped out and I was, or someone in the group was preparing a big uh, elaborate show topic, um, th that one host dropping out wouldn't really change things all that much. Um, but yeah, nowadays- it's easy to adapt. Right. When there are three people, if one of those three people drops out, or if there are two people and one of those two people drop out and then another one subs in, that can kind of fundamentally change what we can and can't talk about. If I'm preparing a show topic that has to do with Mega Man and like only two of the three of us know anything about Mega Man and then one of those two people drops out of the podcast, then we gotta kind of have to pivot at the last minute and there were definitely a lot of episodes recently that were suffering from that, that were putting more work and stress on us because of that. Um, and so I do think that we shouldn't entirely, even though this is something that we originally moved away from, I suppose it wouldn't hurt to leave a door open to something like that going forward. Yeah, and, and like news and stuff, um, like one of the reasons we, we kind of let it go is because, uh, some of us were feeling like, oh, well, you know, other people talk, I already heard the news today. Other people talk about it. Uh, we don't need to talk about it too. We need to find our own thing. And it's just like, well, why can't we, with what little bit of a platform that we might have also talk about the important newsy type things in the industry uh in the industry that we love and the hobby that we love why can't we contribute our own voice to that um and i think um maybe if we had just had had kind of kept the news part at least a little bit alive you know maybe we limited it to Hey, what's one interesting thing you want to talk about today per host or whatever, instead of here's all the news of the day or, or the week. Um, maybe we couldn't have felt so burnt out on the, the news part. Um, and may, and it would have been easier for us to talk about something and have an opinion on something without having to commit to act to like fully playing everything new that came out that week as well. Um, that you know that's just me though um but yeah kind of like circling back around to what i said at the beginning you know that this isn't goodbye this is see you later for the podcast proper um i think I'm still I'm still interested if 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 you guys are if there's an opportunity where three of us uh, are able to make some time or something like that um, to do the odd reaction stream or to do a game stream if we're bored one night uh, Nathan say you're streaming a game a multiplayer game and we decide hey screw it let's jump in there with them and 
or whatever. Let's play some Fall Guys with Nathan one day or something. Like, this channel is still here. We can still use it for that. I think that's... Kyle and uh, Darth Stradius in the chat uh, says, rankings with a bunch of exclamation marks. Um, yeah. I, I, I don't know where I'm going with this anymore. Yeah. Um, I think, yeah, I, I think the problem is, is that we're just starting to meander and yeah. we've talked about it and we're kind of meandering off. So, um, it's, it's hard, right? Like we created this, um, along with two other people. And I think we'd be remiss not to say thank you to both Mitch George and Alex Ballant. Of course. Yep. For the time that they put into the podcast as well um, and everything they did. The integral parts when we launched this podcast last year or two two years ago. God. Yeah. Um, yeah. So uh, so we'd be remiss to not mention them and say thank you to them as well. Um, and then, yeah. Um, so, yeah, guys, thank you so much. We really do appreciate it. Thank um, you. Yeah. Uh, and then finally, um I guess, sorry, I'm taking this completely over, AJ. My apologies. No, go for it. No, um, no, no. I, I, no. I've sort of lost the, th I, I volunteered to host this one and then I kind of got it way into my own feelings and lost the thread. So you, by all means, like this is, okay. this is our show. You go ahead now. So let's talk quickly about where we're going to be and where you can find us. Um, even though there is no going to be podcast for the future uh for now at least um so cozy where can people find you well as usual uh you can find me over on twitter at alex kazina a-l-e-x uh, k-o-z-i-n-a and of course you can find me uh on my own twitch channel as usual at uh twitch.tv slash cozy bear live k-o-z-i-b-e-a-r-l-i-v-e uh, as I've talked about on previous episodes of the show, uh, I've been doing uh, a Pokemon Emerald Cross Nuzlocke run over there. That's been a lot of fun as of recent. Uh, however, um, as of the recording of this episode, I'm actually a few days away from visiting Spain. So uh, while I will definitely be active on Twitter a fair bit during that trip, uh, you'll have to wait a little bit longer to see me return to Twitch. So just... Hold on out for more of that because we're goodness there if you're looking for it. All right. AJ. Yeah. Um, you can find me all over the internet at Times Hero. I haven't said that for a long, long time. Capital T, capital H. Um, hopefully in this during this hiatus, um, I, I'm able to make the time to do some personal streaming on, on my own channel. Like... Believe it or not, I do enjoy that. I just have a hard time making the time because life gets in the way of things and it's frustrating. Adulting is hard. Uh, yes. Um, I thought life but, finds a way. Uh, it's it's not finding a way for me to stream. So mm -hmm. I am unhappy with it. No. Uh, no, it's... Li life is good and it's, it's better than it has been in, in all the right ways. And yeah. that just makes it hard for, for me to do some of the other things that I, that I want to do. Um, but hopefully during this hiatus, I can do a little bit of that. Um, so that would probably be on Twitch uh, at, you know, it'll be at twitch.tv slash times hero. Um, also with capital T capital H, you can do that everywhere. Um, post to Twitter. I post to, I don't, I post a bunch of Instagram stories right now. There there's an Ontario election happening uh, soon. This week. So make sure you go and vote, um, vote for it out, Let's please. Yes, let's um, fire Doug Ford. Yeah, get him out of there. Uh, that would be great mm -hmm. if we could do that. Um, but um, yeah, um, yeah, that, that's that's my two cents. All right. What do you, what are you doing, Nathan? Uh, so, well, I've made no qualms about how to find me, but find me on Twitter at the underscore NMAC. Uh, more importantly, follow me on Twitch. I think you can just click my thing in the chat and probably just follow me right there. Uh, but if you don't know, it's the underscore NMAC. It recently grew my channel past 75 followers. Hell yeah. Good job, Yay. buddy. We're on the march to 100 right now. Um, and it's been slow growth, but for three months, 
uh, I started this in March. So it's not even like three months. Like, uh, I'm pretty happy with the growth that we've seen. We've had a lot of fun. I'm still figuring out what works and what doesn't right now. I'm a big fall guys kick as I try to get all the fall guys season pass done before, um, the new, the season ends and they do the launch on all the console platforms. And I think it's going to see a bit of a reinvigoration at that point. At least I hope it does. Um, so yeah, please follow me there. Plus Lego building. I may or may not be trying to purchase an Optimus prime, uh, like Lego Optimus prime tonight to build on stream Ooh. in a few weeks. So it'll be fun. Yeah. Um, and I think my wife said I could get it like a week or so ago. And that's what I'm going to continue to say until I buy it. And then told her that she told me it was okay. Mm -hmm. So that's my plan at the moment. <laughs> um, but yeah, so check me out there. You can find me on all the other socials. Um, I think on, I should change it, but on TikTok, it's actually Nathan McInerney and, um, Instagram it's Nathan McInerney. I don't know. Uh, but really follow me on Twitch. That's the big part to find me and Twitter. Um, yeah. Uh, other than that, um, thank you everybody. Uh, um, thanks we've to, had Kyle in the chat here. Thanks to time zero for the sub. Yeah. Ooh, coming right in there, right at the last minute. Yeah. Use, use my prime sub. Uh, yeah. I, I do want to, I feel like, I think I was the first and the last. Wow. Uh, I, I do want to, not, not that we're dead. But go ahead. Sorry. Uh, I, I do want to just end this episode real quick uh, with two quick points. Uh, one, uh, a couple of weeks ago, we said that we would review Sizz and Sleeper on the podcast. Uh, obviously, the time has kind of passed for doing a formal, proper YYZ review segment on that game. Uh, but I will say right here and right now that I beat it uh, about a week ago and I thoroughly enjoyed it. Uh, I highly recommend checking it out if you have ex access to Xbox Game Pass. It's a real great uh, kind of tabletop RPG visual novel uh, hybrid with fantastic writing and some real just fantastic uh, low scale yet very emotional role playing. Go give it a shot. Um, and the other thing I want to say is, uh, you know, I, even though the kind of road up until this point, you know, hasn't been perfect. It's had its uh, bumps here and there. Uh, we managed to put out uh, a total of 114 episodes, plus every single episode that we did that wasn't like uh, officially numbered as part of the uh, canon of Press YZ. And we did a number of uh, exciting streams on the side that weren't even kind of considered part of the canon or non-canon of Press YZ episodes, including our very successful 12-hour live stream. I'm still to this day very impressed by the professionality uh, and effort that everyone gave that particular stream. And whatever happens next with Press YZ, we will always have uh, these things to be proud of. Absolutely. 100%. Absolutely. Um, all right. All right. I um, feel like that successfully concludes our State of the Union. Yeah. Um, so Tune in to me playing Fall Guys tomorrow. And then I'll be live streaming the uh, PlayStation thing on my channel at 6 because they do it at yeah. stupid times. Yeah, if uh, if you remember, uh, come over to this channel and, and type slash host into the chat with your uh, username and then host yourself here too so that the people here can actually see it. And they'll, Man, they'll get... I never remember that. I should remember that. Yeah, you should write that down or something. Yeah. Is there not uh, a way you can do it automatically? It used to be, but they, but they, they removed the feature. Oh, lame. They removed the, like we used to auto host each other all the time. And like all of our, our, our friends and everything, we'd auto host them. And then, and then they took the feature away. I don't know why yep. they did that. I think there's some bullshit, uh, corporate reason they did that. And it's like, mm. it's so stupid. It's so, such a valuable feature to spread awareness to other people not only for your your stream but everybody like somebody else's but mm -hmm. stupid fucking amazon right. man right. hazel's well, also saying goodbye goodbye Bye, hazel. unofficial mascot i can't wait to see you again when you're nice and big she's almost fully grown almost she still looks almost. like a puppy though oh she's gonna look like a puppy for the rest of her life that's well maybe okay we're we're, so. we're really spinning our wheels here <laughs> <laughs> all right let's wrap her up yeah, uh, you were hosting right. AJ, so you finish yep. it up. I'll finish it up. Anything? Any last words? Going once, 
Going twice. Girth. Girthy. Girthy. Thank you for tuning in to Press YYZ. If you enjoyed this broadcast, be sure to follow us on Twitch, subscribe to us on YouTube, and review the show on your podcast service of choice. Uh, you can also check us out on Twitter at Press YYZ and slide into our Discord at invite.gg slash Press YYZ to keep the conversation going. Yes, we're still going to be in that Discord. We're still going to be moderating it. Come hang out. Come say hi. Whatever. We'll be in there. We'll be checking it. We'll be checking in with you guys. We'll be checking in with each other. All that fun stuff. Um, and until next time, whenever that is, thank you for playing. <laughs>